Estamos con Martin Braithwaite, el último refuerzo del FC Barcelona eh, como consecuencia de la lesión de Usman Dembélé y hoy nos va a explicar un poco sus primeras sensaciones eh, en el Barça y bueno, qué idea tiene eh, de estos cuatro y años y medio que, por los que ha firmado por el Barça. Amazing. It's been an amazing start. Uh, it's a big club and um, it's been it's been re really really special. When you see this big club, you don't know what to expect, but you come in and you can just feel it's like a family club. Everyone is treating each other good, and it's just a a warm energy, and and people are just here to make each other feel good and have a good time. Mm, yeah, I know it went really fast, but of course uh, it's always been a dream, and I already believed in it, so. I'm really happy. I don't know when you, maybe you see it's like big players, some of the best players in the world, and they're just down to earth, smiling, want to help you, come and talk to you to make you feel good. It's been really nice, and I've really been appreciating that. Amazing, he's a great guy. He's trying to, to help the players. Been really nice to me to make me integrate in the team. And of course, on the training pitch, he's, he's just amazing, and it's a pleasure to watch. Of course, it's a big difference. Just the quality. The quality is a huge difference. And of course, the way of playing is also a big difference because um, the style of play in Leganes is more to be compact and defend good. And here in Barcelona, it's about having the ball all the time and making the opponent tired by moving the ball fast. No, I feel good. I don't need time to, to, to understand the plays. I feel it's really simple. I try to look at my teammates and When I'm not training, I'm at home looking at videos to even uh, understand better. So I feel it's, 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 it's really easy for me to, to fall into to the connection with all my teammates. It's been, it's been really natural. I just try to watch the, the team play, how they play from the games. I try to watch the, the different kind of players, how do they pass, how do they cross, so I can adapt my game to theirs. Yeah, yeah, like small agreements on the pitch. Of course, we talk together, I move like this and okay, okay. This is, this is football, just to try to get a connection. Honestly, I cannot say, oh, this guy is helping me, because I feel everyone is really trying to help me, I, and I feel I can talk to anyone. There's no, no one that I, can, that I can talk to. Everyone is nice to me. If I go and talk to them, they take time to talk to me about everything. So honestly, it's, it's, it's really nice. Of course, it was a surprise, and I was, really, uh, I was really happy. I didn't know what to expect, because I'm just here to play football, and I don't think about what's going on outside the pitch, but uh, I was... I was really happy and also um, I just want to say I feel like I feel like all the all the supporters on the, in the stadium because I'm also just a football fan I'm a football fan so I know what they're feeling and yeah it's a dream for me I, I want to show them if I can make it the kids who come to the stadium or the, all, all the people who are in the stadium they can also uh, go and get their dreams so for me I'm just like I'm like the people in the stadium I'm just on the pitch playing and for me it's amazing because for me I'm not important, for me it's them who's, who's important because they're, they're really creating the story and it's them who are really like creating the Barca history and they're there supporting the club and I'm just lucky enough to be part of the club and, and to play and I'm gonna give uh, 100% to, to make them happy so I want to pay them back for, for, this good, uh, for this good receiving that they made to me in the stadium. Yes. Um... I remember my first goal here, I was really, really happy, of course, because when I played Barcelona, it's a team I want to do something. I want to do something special. I want them to see me because, of course, I want to show that I can play in this team. And I'm happy that I've done enough, that I'm finally here. And uh, I think about it every day, my first goal and come now, just to, to score a goal and, and just feel this with the fans, like this is something really special in this amazing stadium. No, any, not, not, I don't have anything in mind because football is a lot of love and passion and when I score goals I love the feeling because you don't know what to expect, you just feel the love from the fans, you feel the good energy, the passion and for, I'm a player, I just let it out, so I'm nothing planned. This is something you can't really plan, it's just something that comes natural. Yeah, of course, like I said all, all the time, I'm going to be in Barcelona for a long time and i'm gonna i'm gonna show it now I'm, i just i just want to come and play football it is i love i have a lot of belief in myself and i play with amazing players so these amazing players they 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 help me a lot and 
they're gonna make it uh, more easy for me just to go and play my football because of course these players they're so good at uh, at their job though so they help me uh, even more it's just one point I know uh, I know this team and uh, I can feel there's a really really good atmosphere it's a good energy that family feeling a lot of positivity and always they will pay back and uh, we have 12 games left there's a lot of games but we don't have to think about other teams and ourselves. We just have to go and win the games. And I'm 100% confident that, that we're going to win the league. 100%. I believe in this and this is what I'm going to work for. I'm not going to say anything else because this is the ambition of, of the club and this is the ambition of, for me. So this, this is what I want to go and do. Yeah, I don't think we have to change too much. Sometimes, in some moments, uh, it, it all depends on what you look at. When I came, first game we won 5-0. Second game, second game we play Napoli away. I feel we control, we control control of the game. It's sure it's true that we didn't create many chances, but we get 1-1. Napoli is a difficult place to play. It's not bad. Like people, they expect us to go and win 3-4-0 every game because we are Barcelona. And if we don't do this, it's it's a disaster. But for where I'm looking at it. We're doing really good. And then we played El Clasico. First half was really good. Second half, we were a little bit under pressure, but this is this is also one of the best teams in the world we're playing. And in the end, if you look at it, they had the extra luck to win the games. We also had our chances to win. And um, this game was not really ours to win. And we just have to learn from it. Because of course, you can always learn, you can always be better. But I'm really positive. I feel we're in a really good dynamic and we just have to continue. Yeah, but that's life, you know, that's life. Uh, I'm not really worried. The only thing I can do is just give myself my energy to the team and and give them energy to go and play the game and win and, and support them because in the future I'll also be playing Champions League here. So right now it's not about me, it's about the team. Of course, I always did this in my whole career. I work in, in everything I can do. I like to work physically a lot and technically, but also the mind. The mind is really important because for me, the mind is everything. So I use a lot of time working on my mind since I was really young. I think it's not a time that I remember a lot because I think I deleted it because it's not a happy time in my life. So I think it just did something in myself to live every day 100%. And when I like in everything I do, I give 100%. And that's what I'm going to do here when I play. I love to play beautiful football. This is what I this is how I feel football should be played with football, but also with a lot of passion. You give everything. Some days you don't you don't really play so good, but you give 100% every time. It was it was it was special for me, and I also have an understanding for people in this situation now. I know I can I, I can have a feeling of what they're thinking and what they're going through. So I have an understanding for these for I understanding for for people in in the same situation uh, as I was. So. I'm no more different than anyone. I'm, I'm just the same normal guy like everyone. Always, everything I do, it makes me stronger. Good and bad, it's always positive because it makes me stronger and it helps me to develop as a person. So that's, that's how I look at life. What they call me, Martin, like they want, huh? like, they, like they want. This is, this is not me who to decide my name is Martin, but if then they have a nickname to me or whatever, honestly, they call me what they want. It depends who I have, Braith, I have Mac, it's, it's been my Mac has been my, my nickname since I was really young, and Brave has just been my na nickname since going to the national team. And with my last name, it's, it's really easy. So I don't know. Uh, I always love playing in number nine, and number nine is not available, so number 19. Yeah, of course. <laughs> I don't know if I, I can repeat it. You can never repeat the legend. You can only create your own history. So I can never repeat what he did. I can only create my mind. But. He had an amazing season in Barca and on my iPad, I have uh, all his goals from the year in Barca and I study them and I look at them because, uh, like I said, it's an idol of me and I, I try to look at everything he did to help me be a better player. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Um, I, I think we just, I don't know. I think maybe the way we play, if we go together and I also try to look at him, how we play. And I, I know I have an idea of how he pass, his movements, how he's trying to look for people. And I'm just gonna try to get in those spaces that he pass. And it succeeded already a little bit, but I'm sure in the future it's gonna be more and more because we're gonna understand each other even more in the coming games. 
I always pray, I always talk to God and, and just, just say thank you for him, being grateful for everything I have. And then I just go on. It's about always being, being grateful for what you have. People who believe in God, people who don't believe in God. It's a good feeling to be happy for what you got. There's always something to be happy for in your life, no matter where you are. And that helps you to, to get more stuff to be happy about. Yes, of course, the, this is what I believe. This is what I work for, of course, but you also have an opponent. But I don't think about this when I'm playing, I, re I play with belief. What happens, happens. But like I said earlier, when I play, I go 100% with belief and that's it. There's another thing going and being convinced and then just doing nothing, just think it comes by itself. No, you have to believe, but you have to work really, really hard. And that's what I'm doing, just working really hard. I promise I'm going to do, I'm going to be the happiest man alive. That's, that's, that's a promise. Like <laughs> no, I don't think so. Honestly, I'm just going to be, uh, I'm going to be really happy because this is a goal for me to win the league. So I'm going to be extremely happy.